Hello guys, this is Sugarsus Crypto. On this video, I'm about to get, help you guys how to make your Daedalus Reward Incentive Testnet Wallet 2.1.0 synchronize a lot faster than before. Now obviously, I wouldn't have done this thanks to the IOHK support that has provided me with this simple follow instructions that I'm about to give to you guys. Now it's very important that you guys understand that these instructions that I'm about to give to you guys are only good until the month of March before the Byron reboot, which is gonna make a major improvement to the Deadless wallet with a set of new rules, with new code, faster memory, synchronizing, and recovery time. And this will happen thanks to this Ouroboro BFT that just happened this week. Um, thanks to that, this major improvements are gonna happen by March. Now, I just must say that I, ha I was fed up with the synchronization on day dealers. Of course, I have to bear with these developers, and I do understand, and many of you have to understand, that we're in a test phase on Cardano, and that the Daedalus wallets are not gonna respond as, as you like it to be. A very important thing to remember is that Cardano's Daedalus wallet is not just a wallet, is a node connected to other nodes around the world being part of what is Cardano's network. Now, a lot of people say, oh, but the Neo wallet, what functions better? How about other wallets on other developments work a lot faster? Yes, I understand there's better wallets out there, but this is not about now. This is about long-term huddle. This is about the long-term perspective of this blockchain that has been built to scale worldwide and does not not encounter problems like the EOS has encountered, like the Ethereum has encountered, and like the Bitcoin has encountered when it comes to scalable issues. And we want to solve that. We want to be scalable. We want to be interoperable with the whole entire blockchains out there in the world. And we want to be the internet of blockchain. So in order to do so, we have to be careful. We have to take it steady and not go too fast because this is a race of being the best blockchain, not the fastest to be developed. So putting that aside, I just want to point out to you guys that I, I have fed up with the data list, right? Because I, I have my frustrations like just like any of y'all. So I, what I did was I opened my Google Chrome browser and I downloaded the Shelly testnet wallet. And I've been using that. I transfer my funds to delegate to pulls on that light wallet client, which is doesn't not have the whole blockchain recorded. It does have a copy of it, but it does not have, it's not a node. Another note to consider, I did not move transfer my testnet ADA. I just basically downloaded the, the Euro staking testnet and I just barely went to the transfer funds from legacy Daedalus and I just basically enter my 12 war recovery phrase used to back up my Daedalus wallet to restore the balance and transfer all the funds from the Daedalus to Yoroi. Remember, this is just the testnet to testnet. The Daedalus testnet to the Yoroi testnet. It will take about a minute to restore my balance. In the next step, you will be able to present with a transaction that will move all their funds over. Please review the details to the transaction carefully. You will need to pay a standard transaction fee on the Cardano network to make this transaction. Remember that. The Daedalus is a node, and that's part of the delay when it comes to synchronization, that the Daedalus is a big node with the whole entire blockchain recorded to it, linking to other nodes around the world, making it part of the whole entire Cardano network. What a sophisticated way, right? Hey, what a beautiful design. But we have to bear with it because it's on the development phase. Obviously, we're on the on the transaction of the proof of stake Shelly, which is which is on its way. But I didn't want it to lose rewards. I wanted to keep delegating. I wanted to make sure that I'm earning ADA or as much ADA as I possibly can before it goes to the mainnet. Once it goes to the mainnet, a lot of people are going to be out there starting to delegate, people that they cannot delegate right now, people that didn't have ADA prior November snap screenshot or snapshot, they're going to be participating on the mainnet. And I want to take advantage right now since we're in a test phase and very, is there limited people participating and I want to take advantage of that. Now, the, the drawback about the Yoroi Shelly testnet is that they don't have the same metrics as the Daedalus. 
it, do, it does not have that. So I have to be using adapools.org to try to look for the blocks per epoch on um, each individual pool, the ROIs, the stake delegation quantities they have available. And I have to make sure that I'm using that platform, the website, so I could determine my best decision on which pool to delegate to. Now, let's get into the daily list reward incentive test 2.1.0 procedure to try to make it faster. Now, in order to make it sync faster, if you have not downloaded, I'll be leaving links in the description below so you could download it. And, um, and whoever has downloaded already, what you need to do is open up the wallet, right? Click understand. After you click understand, there's three little icons at the bottom. Choose the middle one, the Cardano node not synchronizing. Click on it, open it, look for the state, the Cardano or the Daedalus state directory. Click the, uh, the little button that says open. It'll give you, it'll pull up like 13 files. Select all 13 files or 14 or 12 or whatever. Select them all and delete them all or put them on the recycle bin. Just get them out of the system, delete them. And then close the wallet back down again and then open it back up and then you have to re-input like your passphrase and all over again so you can recover your wallet again. When you do that, after that, the synchronization time will shorten and it'll have better time frame to open up the wallet, you know, than, prior, than before, than it did before. I hope that makes sense to any of y'all. I'll be leaving links in the description below you might want to look into. Um, I appreciate you, the new subscribers. Thank you for subscribing. Make sure to support this channel by hitting the like, subscribing, and sharing. Guys, please have a good weekend. Take it easy and take care. Peace out.